Hello, and welcome to the Pharmacy Times News Network. I'm Ashley Talamo, publisher of Pharmacy Times, and your host for our Pharmacy Week in Review. Old drugs with new price hikes are adding another dimension to the national drug pricing debate. Turing Pharma increased the price of Daraprin by 5,000% overnight after purchasing the rights to the decades-old taxoplasmosis drug in August. Turing's CEO originally claimed that the $750 per tablet cost was not excessive. But on Tuesday night, the company backpedaled on this cost increase, saying it would lower the drug's price to a more affordable point. The FDA is changing the dispensing requirements for colozapine to address new safety concerns about severe neutropenia. Starting October 12th, pharmacies must be certified in the shared colozapine REMS program in order to dispense the schizophrenia drug. Pharmacists will no longer be able to enroll patients in the colozapine REMS program or view a list of patients taking colozapine unless they are prescriber designees. Pharmacies in areas affected by wildfires in California can provide prescription medications under a waiver granted by the state's pharmacy board. At an emergency meeting, the California State Board of Pharmacy issued an exemption for pharmacists to dispense medically necessary drugs to affected patients without a prescription. Board President Dr. Amy Gutierrez told Pharmacy Times, it is our goal that the board's actions have led to an increased ability for pharmacists working in impacted areas to provide critical medication access. The waiver will stay in effect until California Governor Jerry Brown's declaration of emergency has been removed, or until further notice from the State Pharmacy Board. Pharmacists may be asked more questions about Harvoni during Gilead's direct-to-consumer ad campaign about the hepatitis C treatment. The commercial touts Harvoni as a once-daily pill for 12 weeks that's the one and only cure for hepatitis C. I don't want to live with the uncertainties of hep C. Or wonder whether I should seek treatment. I am ready. Because today, there's Harvoni, a revolutionary treatment for the most common type of chronic hepatitis C. Harvoni is proven to cure up to 99% of patients who've had no prior treatment. It's the one and only cure. That's one pill, once a day, for 12 weeks. For more great coverage and practical information for today's pharmacist, visit our website and sign up for our daily e-news. And don't forget to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Thanks for watching our Pharmacy Week in Review. I'm Ashley Talamo at the Pharmacy Times News Network.